We are one week away from the opening of the 2023 Santa Barbara International Film Festival. This morning, we are joined by a very special guest, Roger Durling, the executive director of the festival. Thank you so much for joining us of, this morning. Of we course. so appreciate it. Hey, likewise. I love waking up to you guys every morning. We appreciate that. We're so happy to hear that. Okay, you've been doing this for 21 years. Yes. Talk about the weeks and the days leading up to the festival. I know you're preparing year round, but how hectic is it right now as you get it's closer? Pretty, it's pretty busy, but we've been fortunate. As you mentioned, we've been doing this for 21 years and most of the crew that works with me have been doing this for many, many years. So we have it dialed in and, and we love what we do. All right, so we have so many big names getting awards this year. Angela Bassett, Kate Blanchett, Jamie Lee Curtis, Brandon Frazier, Colin Farrell, so many big names getting tributes and awards. How do you get these people every year to come? Um, I think now we have a reputation and it's easy um, to put it together. Um, what, I pri what I love the most is that we, we, um, we figure it out pretty early on. Uh, this year, Angela Bassett and Jamie Lee Curtis, when we announced them, people were asking me, really? Mm -hmm. And um, and to see that they they get their due, uh, both got nominated for Best Supporting Actress, is it's, it's exciting. It's a lot of fun. Yeah, you really have to have foresight because your festival comes well before the Oscar nominations are announced. After, yes. Right, you're yeah. right, exactly. So yeah. talk about that. Yeah, we pick them really early on. I mean, since I was a little kid, I don't want to, I don't want to bore you too much, but since I was a little kid, that that's what I, I would do. I had charts in my room of the possible people that were going to get nominated, and I always was right on the money. And it's 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 funny that I make a living now doing what I used to do as a as a kid. It it is a gift. It is a gift to be able to identify what is quality movie cinema. All right, what are you most excited about this year? Um, what are you looking forward to? You know. N not a lot of people know that during the mornings of the festival, we have all these educational programs. And this year, Guillermo del Toro, uh, who's Academy Award winning, one of the greatest filmmakers, is going to spend time with the kids. The, the third graders to sixth graders, they, goes, they get bussed in from far north from uh, Santa Maria. Uh, they get bussed in. They're going to watch Guillermo's film, Pinocchio and then they're gonna ask questions and chat with Guillermo. And that to me, to see those kids' faces, um, this is one of their idols. And to see them face to face and to have their questions answers, answered is pretty amazing. And who knows, one of these kids will become a major filmmaker and they were inspired by an, by an, ev by an event like this. So. That to me is it's icing on the cake. It's and you guys bring so much attention to so many smaller budget films that people might have not otherwise seen. Just talk about that as well. Yeah, I mean, uh, drawing attention to small films, but also the fact that us, um, you know, film goers will normally not get a chance to see those films. Um, independent films, foreign films, documentaries, social okay. justice aspects. Um, you know, th those films don't get a lot of distribution and they're hard to access. So for 10 days, you have over 200 films that will be at the festival. Uh, 43 countries are represented and a lot of the filmmakers fly into town and you get to um, see the films and, and listen to the filmmakers speak uh, in person. We also have, I don't know if you're aware, we have all the nominated screenwriters um, we have the writers panel, we have the producers panel, yes, where all the nominated producers will be there. Uh, this year, brand new and it's for free. Um, on the first Sunday, we're gonna have the five nominated best international feature films. Wow. And the directors will be there at the Arlington Theater. That's the first time in the history of the festival we're doing the best international feature. It's about time. And I'm excited that the five um, films and directors will be there.
All right, Santa Barbara's just a buzz when the film festival <laughs> starts. And the film festival starts on February 8th. You can get all of the info you need at sbiff.org and all film info and the schedule also on the app. Thank you so much. Such of course. an honor to have you this morning. Oh, likewise. You, I wake you, I told you, I wake up every morning to you and Annika. So it's exciting to be here. We appreciate that. We're going to use that in a promo. <laughs>